something stinks. Can you smell it? No. No. Oh, it's like toilets. Stale toilets. Oh, yeah, sorry, Scout. <laughs> <laughs> uh, where's Mr Chalk? <whistles> I said, where's Mr Chalk? He's not here. Well, what do you mean he's not here? What is he popped out of? He's not here, he's not here. Miss Bryan, where have you been? Where is Mr Chalk? Right, I'll meet you back down at the office, thank you. The rest of you, sit back down, please. I'll be sending up some cover in a minute, so don't get excited. And then suddenly, the fire alarm started going off, so everyone started legging it into the car park, pyjamas and everything, and um, then I left my keys in the flat. And Daniel? What the same. Right, so both you and Daniel locked yourselves outside your flats? Nightmare. And then we had to wait for hours for the fire brigade to break back in for us. Why didn't you call? Well, because I dropped my phone and the fire engine ran over it and then it got smashed to pieces. Right, look. Lorraine asked me to do a job and Chalky said that he was going to drop Cheryl off and he didn't turn up and he's not going to even touch him. Dead Lorraine already. should have known that you needed to be here. It won't happen again. You're absolutely right, it won't happen again. Have you any idea how serious this is? I can't run a school like this. No more disappearing acts, Janice. And consider this an official warning. What? But this office is the beating heart of Waterloo Road. I need you totally committed. And I am. And no more personal calls. Fine. <sighs> Sorry. Janice. Janice! <laughs> What's with a shocked face, Connor? I've seen a ghost. Um, teaching in Glasgow before. My son and I just fancied a change. Let me get that for you. Yeah, sure. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> 